Sagittarius, ain't no song playing for you. It's an advertisement. So with that, you're going to have to let me know what you got going on. But um, you may be thinking about some something that was expressed to you or something you want to express, but you're not going to express whether you would, if someone expressed something towards you immaturely or you expressed someone something to someone immaturely, you feel me? You would you wanted to make a change or you wanted look, you wanted to manifest. I'm shuffling so this ain't gonna come out, but I'm gonna show it to you. You wanted to manifest something, so now it's like you thinking about your abundance and how you can obtain you and that. This is someone that's playing for you. So you trying you picturing you yourself with something, you and that, whatever that is for for you. You feel me? You want something. Or you desire something or you crave something and you want to be a part of that. You want to be in that space. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I got a throwback. Uh, Sagittarius. Yeah, you may be in a space where it's like you withdrawn. You just took a step back from either expressing yourself emotionally or just receiving emotions from people. You the the emotional window, the feelings window for Sagittarius may be closed. Or you accepted emotions from someone or an emotional based idea that you should not have accepted. You thought this emotional based idea was gonna bring you abundance. You thought, but it may have been may have been a negative manifestation for you. Something may have worked against you th that you thought would work with you. And look, you, know, you may have been in emotional turmoil or just a state of emotional loss over what put what you emotionally invested in, what the emotions you took from something, the feelings you took from something or someone. Look, someone bought something or someone bought you feelings and that may have confused you in some way, shape, or form. And now you're just not receiving feelings or emotions from people anymore outside of you. Look, you're not, you're not taking as cool, you're not acting or, or receiving or doing as fast as you know you can. Sagittarius the Archer, and if I was, look, if I could look at this card, I would look at this card as fucking arrows, you feel me? And... You're not, you're not, you're not investing in something as fast as you usually do, or you would. You feel me? Cause something changed. Because you took, it's like you made, you took a bad step, and that bad step changed how you handle things. Based off emotions, you feel me? So you may be trying to obtain something. You and that, you want to be a part of something. But you 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 not doing it how you used to do it or how you usually go about something. You feel me? You don't want to. Damn, I just seen the uh, Eight of Cups in reverse. It's just like you don't want. Look what came out the Wizard in reverse. You may not be manifesting right, Sagittarius. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm gonna be honest with you. Or someone outside of you is is in, is in your space and it's like they're using you to manifest negatively. You feel me? It's almost like someone wants you to be in this space, wants you to be in a state where you're not accepting and or giving or making emotional ID. Man, it's like someone does wants you to be in the space of being still. And that's what they're mad. So they're throwing negative man negativity, whether it's negative thoughts and feelings or just negative ideas or just negative passions. They want you to be in the space you're in. You feel me? Someone wants you here and you're there. You're not, whether you're not taking emotional action or receiving or just being open to emotional action. Shit, you're not doing nothing is what it looked like. Type shit is the song that's playing for you. The judgment. Someone doesn't want you to call judgment on something. And the only way they know to keep you to not, from not calling judgment on something is to bring you bullshit in some way, shape, or form. Whether it's emotional manipulation, energetic manipulation, mental manu manipulation, or verbal manipulation. Somebody trying to control you. They manifest in using lies. They're, if it's their passion, then it could be their organs. They're using their sex organs or they're using something they're actually passionate about against you or on you in order to keep you in this position. 
But somebody doesn't want you to look, somebody doesn't want you what? Thinking about the fact that you may be in a lack situation. Because you're passionate about something. But you're just not doing, you're not doing something or going about something the way you could be. Look, on the split, you're passionate about something, healing, you feel me? You may want to heal something you're passionate about, but in order to do that, you got to bring death. Rebirth cannot occur unless there is death. Look, you're nurturing something. You're investing your energy into something you may need to be defensive towards because what you are nurturing in is just something that is holding on to you. You may, whether it's a negative mentality or a person place a thing outside of you, you got some bad habits. You need to, it's like your bad habits are keeping you stuck, are keeping you from opening up or just being in the state to receive or give or offer. Whether you're the cloud coming to someone or someone, this, this cloud is someone coming to you. You feel me? You know, you put your foot in the shoe that fits you. Regardless, you're not in that space. It's like you're in you, son. You, you got a lot of passion, you got a lot of fire, but you're sitting with it for some reason. You feel me? It's like you're an archer with no arrows. Or you're, you're an archer that doesn't, you, you don't really care to shoot an arrow. Oh shit, that's a whole lot of cards. All of those, uh, yeah, it's, you feel like you're stuck in something. Or you stuck in the mentality. It's probably whether it, if it's you versus you, you just thinking negative. You ain't thinking right. You keep you you nurturing just negative thoughts or just negative mentalities. You not you not thinking positive in regards to something, and that's putting you in the space to not walk away from something you need to walk away from. What's on the bottom again? The ten of coins in reverse. You thinking? Look what's behind that. You thinking about lack. You don't want to walk away from the, those thoughts. So it's like you can't manifest something greater until you can see yourself being greater. You feel me? Queen of Wands. It's like you're nurturing something you're passionate about, but it may not be good for you. You, you may be well, these thoughts, whatever you're taking care of. See, you got passion. You internalize something. It's like something you find stability in something almost. But that what you find stability in may not be for you. See that black cat you with, that black cat that you got with you may not be a good black cat. It could be a bad a bad black cat. A black cat that's really keeping you confused. But you think it's your companion. You feel me? You you feel like you how you internalize about this, it's like it's like the type of per the last person you would expect. You know how on Scooby Doo when they be hunting the villains and all that shit, it be the it be the person who be helping them hunt the monsters that be the one under the mask type shit. It's that type situation. It's the person you would least suspect that's actually holding you back. Hey, but hey, put your foot in the shoe that fits you when it come to that shit. All right. If now if I'm talking and you as soon as I said what I said, you thought about some people, then you might just need to go a little undercover and figure figure some shit out, connect some dots. If some names came to your mentality when I said that, then you got some shit you gotta handle. You feel me? But that that don't gotta go for everybody. Someone that's playing for you is big big tipper. See, I'm telling you. They just, they just see you then. You might just be nothing but a bank account to somebody. You're going to have to let me know, though. I'm going to fuck with you. 